we do play VATs, I think it's on Thursday, and we yeah, do play Thursday, VATs yeah. at the weekend. Now, I'm hoping for a new manager bounce. I mean, VATs will probably be all right, but Everton, Ooh, I call... Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Please, I'm trying to be positive, man. <laughs> no, uh, listen, we're all positive, but mm. I don't get where Nuno was changing nine, ten players to go to Vitesse. Mm. Why didn't he play his best team for three games and then you got nine He's points, okay. have a rest? Mm. Yeah. yeah. That's, you know, it's, it, I just don't get all this dropping players. Oh, they might be tired. Oh, don't don't go there. I don't want to go there. <laughs> That's what I thought we'd bypass VATs. But people have told me they've they have beat us away. Thank you, Jay. And uh, Dan. They have beaten us, so we do have to actually turn up against them. Well, um, we're third I mean, at the moment, so we mm. need to get some points, otherwise we're not yeah. gonna go through. No, we so. we don't win them, we don't go through. Yeah, so we actually need to <laughs> <laughs> turn oh, up. Mate. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, this is the thing. Obviously, we're all starving for a cup. Um and lots of people are saying if they're going to go out of one, it's going to be this one. Now, I'll throw it out to you first, Abby. We never want to drop out of cup because we're so, like I've said, starving for one. But do you think maybe it'd be a blessing in disguise if we do drop out of it, do you think? Uh, yeah, I didn't want to be in it in the first place. I know that lots of people say, well, beggars can't be choosers. And, you know, if you're in a European competition, yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, I think that when you're in a competition that genuinely lets you just, sorry, my laptop's about to die, that um, literally gives you an opportunity to get into the Europa League. I don't think it's enough incentive. I would much rather have just one game a week. Focus on that because I don't think this team is good enough to be able to play on a Thursday night, whether it is in some weird, you know, European competition. Um, I would rather just have the focus on ba back to basics, which I think Tottenham Hotspur need to do, and focus on that and focus on the league and focus on being in a Carabao Cup or focus on the FA Cup when it comes around. I think they're way, way more important than having this cup. It's not a significant European trophy, for, for my opinion. Um, and I think that we could do without it, to be honest with you. So if we went out, would I care? No, not really. Um, I think the situation we're in again, if we were at a more stable position, I'd say fine. Um, but I'd also hope if we were in a more stable position, we wouldn't be in this competition in the first place. Mm, that is very true. I mean, Patrick, what are your kind of thoughts? Um, is this something you wouldn't mind dipping out of? I mean, Kev said, why are we so snobby? I feel it's not about snobbiness. I think it's about not the quality of it, but what that the means point. for us. Yeah, what, no, the point of it? You know what? I, I totally hear what I'd be saying, but I want us to go for this, man. We need some sort of trophy, some sort of silverware. And the fact that we're in it, we're, we're in it because we deserve to be in it. We were seventh place. That is where we are right now. I mean, we're currently eighth. So it's kind of our level. But we are, we, us and Roma are probably the two biggest teams in that competition. So we should be going all out to win it. In my opinion, the players need to actually turn up and flip and win the cup, win the trophy. And then it sort of will breed some confidence and instill some sort of winning mentality and we push on from there. Because we can't keep turning on up at this trophy, turning our nose up at this trophy, this cup. What We can't be so snobby and picky when we haven't won a trophy in, what, 12, 11, 13 years? So for me, I would say go all out and win it, especially with Conte coming in, and then we take it from there. Mm. I agree. I think Listen, that is true. Mm. Uh, sorry, Ellen, on. I agree. That's right. Listen, you, you enter a competition to win it. You don't enter a competition to say, well, I don't want to win that one. I don't yeah, want exactly. It. Because no disrespect, if we get knocked out of this one, and we get knocked out the week after West Ham, and we get Liverpool in the FA Cup, we got some season, haven't we? We ain't going to win yeah. the league. So you might as well go for any, like, go for anything. Yeah. But it's, try to stay in it as long as you can. You know, and, and you never know what happens. Okay, but just a question for you. Let's say it gets to March time, whatever, and let's say that we've got a game in this competition. Yeah. And we have a uh, when we care about cup. Let's say we have an FA Cup semi final. Let's say what one no, do you care April, more about? In, yeah. All right, in um, April. Let what what one do you care more about? Um, I would care for both of them because let but, but Spurs probably could, we don't have the squad depth. I don't believe to be able to do both well. Which one would you care more about? I would. I would. Well, it's very hard because if you if you say you're gonna prioritise the FA Cup and you go out of that you somebody will say to you oh she got a disc somebody would <laughs> say to you that um, why did you not go for the 
the the conference cup mm. and that's you know it's I've... you can't you can't go picking what cup you want to win you've got to just you know what and the conference and see where it leads you yeah, the conference league as well. That that will push up our co-efficiency points. So when they do bring in, when they do bring in um, uh, the extra spots in the in the Champions League in a couple of years, we're right there at the moment because we always qualify for Europe, barring yeah. this season. So we need those extra co-efficiency points. Uh, so winning the conference league this year will really help us with that. I want us to win it. To be honest, we're in it for the first time. I don't ever want to see us in there again. But whilst we are in there, let's go out and win it. When this Chelsea is... are in the Europa League, they go and win it. You know, yeah. when Man United are in the Europa League, they go and, well, other than last year, and they go and win it. So when these teams drop down, typically they go and win it. Why Why should we have that same mentality? Mm, okay. That is interesting. I, mean, I do get what Abby's saying. I mean, when you look at, obviously, she's gone again. She's, she's like she's agreeing a, with her. Uh, I've actually <laughs> died, I think, on the laptop, so she's trying to sort her phone out. Yeah, um, I do agree to the sense. Oh, uh, yeah, she's, she's back. I'm, here, I'm you're so sorry. You're disagreeing with my point then. I'm agreeing with you. <laughs> you <laughs> left. <laughs> and also, I've left oh. my headphones in the car. It's just, I'm not having a good day. No, we can hear you. We can hear you. So you're as long as you and can you're hear here. me. I can, I can hear you, but it's really low. So I'm just trying oh, to sit okay, really okay. close with it to my ear. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right, Abby, you're here. That's all that matters. But I do agree with you saying in the sense that which one do you rate higher, this and the other. But... For me, after only seeing, obviously, the League Cup for 2008 and everybody bantering about the Audi Cup, yeah. I just need the trophy. I don't care what it is at this point in time. Um, but hopefully we do manage to beat the Ateez and we can carry on. 